I really love the sprint series because it's all about all about racing, you know. Everything has to be really fast, like the pit stop, the tire change, the driver change. Everything must be really, really fast. Battling literally wing to wing, wheel to wheel, front to back, everything. It's all going on. It's live, it's there, it's it's fantastic. Incredible level of fast drivers and professional drivers good teams, pure race, and the concept to put the endurance and the sprint series together in the same championship is amazing. I really love to drive in a sprint series, actually, not, maybe not allowed to say, but more than endurance, because sprint qualifying is very important. You have to put everything together, it's very competitive. Only one hour, you know, a half an hour stint, so at the start and every opportunity you got, you have to take full risk. You've got a very good field. Many nice cars, many good teams, really strong driver lineups. So it's it's very very competitive, and this is what a, a racing driver wants to have. So you have to be there on point every weekend. is really important. Uh, qualifying race, you have to be uh, as good as you can to have a good base for the championship race uh, for good points. It's exciting with the fast driver change. Everything has to work together with the mechanics. Really tough, but it's really nice to drive. It's a one-hour race, and it's it's a hundred percent pushing from the start till the checkered flag. And this is the one what a racing driver wants to have. You know, it's like everything must be like like an explosion. You must be from the beginning on until the end. You have to give a hundred percent. Great experience to be back again in the Brown Burn Sprint Series. We competed already in 2014 in this very beautiful series. And it's a big, big pleasure to be again here because it's an amazing grid, it's an amazing feel. And the biggest difference on the Brown Burn Sprint Series is for sure, it's pure racing. It's pure racing when you have a pit stop, when the guys, your mechanics have to give all. Everybody of the team has to make a big influence on the race result. And this is so unique worldwide in GT racing. Really good thing to be here. This is the hardest championship I've ever done. Um, at the start of, uh, start of the year, I didn't realize how tricky it was going to be. Absolutely every team is 110% on it all the time. Uh, down to the, the pit stops and everything. It's a massive team effort, great fun, but it is one heck of a hard championship to win. And hopefully next year, the Sean and myself will be back and uh, pushing hard to be right up there at the front, but it's definitely one I want to win and uh, have on uh, my trophy shelf. There's no doubt that the Blancpain series is the best GT series worldwide, no doubt about it. You need to really be pushing for half an hour, you don't really need to worry too much about the tyres uh, if they last for an hour stint. You have to take any chance you can get. It's just really quick, high energy. Two fantastic races and really maximum attack from everybody. Every single lap is a qualifying lap. You really have to cut the edge of your driving and it's absolutely fantastic to watch and that's why we're also still here at the last round and we have three teams which can win the championship. Absolutely mind-blowing. Oh, you have half an hour, fresh set of tires and here it's consistent, flat out, 10-10 all the time. But he's going to hold on to see the checker flag, to win the race and to win the Blanc Pan Sprint Series of 2015. Absolute delight in the pit lane. Vincent Abril in tears. It's victory for HDP Bentley. Vincent Abril and Maximilian Buch are the drivers' champions.